So can you just talk about um, the fact that you guys are practicing, you know, at this point last year, you guys were, you know, how good is it just to be back out here? For me personally, like I, 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 I told um, Mr. Henry over there earlier, yeah, as a senior, that's, that's guaranteed football, you know. You know, past this is just uh, – it's up in the air. You never know if, what will happen. But right now, I'm, I'm living in the moment. And I'm enjoying, you know, wearing the wearing the Carolina on the front of my jersey and, and working hard for this, this organization. Are you guys anxious to you know, get back out there and yeah. show you guys are better than you know, the Clemson game? Or Absolutely. You know, a, a chance at, in terms of slight redemption and, and to show, you know, that that's not indicative of who we are as a team is is cer certainly um, substantial to us. How's Jake bounce back? since the Clemson game? Like, how, how often have you been able to see him since then, and how's he been in practice so far? Yeah, Jake's, a, like I said earlier, Jake's a competitor. You know, he's he's a fierce competitor. He's, of course, the coach's son, and he uh, he enjoys the process. And I think Jake has really bounced back. He's not, he's not down. He's not sad. He's not sluggish. He's just excited about the next opportunity and, and excited about the process and playing and learning the game as he, as he goes. Did you or anyone else have talks with him after Clemson to make sure he was good or just assume he was going to be fine because of who he is? I mean, yeah, you talk to him a little bit. That's your quarterback, you know. That's, that's, you don't want to sound like Terrell Owens, but you know, that's, that's, your quarter, that's, your, that's my quarterback, man. And you put an arm around him and tell him, you know, hey, look, we got another opportunity. And some people mock me for that, you know, after the Clemson game, telling him we had another opportunity to play ball. But the fact of the matter is, you know, we, we do. And we have a chance to, to show that we're better than what we what we put on film uh, against Clemson. And Jake's going to be fine, and we're going we're gonna to roll from there. Coaches said that they were going to spend a couple weeks kind of doing quality control, looking back over the season and, and self-study. Have they talked to you guys about anything they took from that, or have they done anything differently through some practices because of that? You know, that's kind of like a – I consider that, and, and I'm leaving, so of course you know I'm out of the door. But I consider that kind of like spring cleaning. You know, you go through the, you go through the season. And, I apologize. You go through the season, and, and you you get banked up. You get you know some guys may have not performed as you would like them to. Some guys performed way better than you'd like them to, and you just kind of look back and you and you reorganize things. Maybe a little bit of restructure, and, and you get the wheels turning for the next season. I, I arrived late. So what, what first? Put, um, first couple of days with Coach Latino, what have they been like? Oh, fantastic! Yeah, yeah. I, I you know, I appreciate him coming into a awkward situation. You know, coaching an offense line that may have already had their call set by another coach, and he's kind of having to learn what we learned and then put forth what he knows. And what, what he knows is limitless. I mean, that, he's been around the game for a long time, and I, you know, every chance I get, I'm gonna try to pick his brain. Have you tweaked anything? That's amazing. Change. Obviously, he's gonna come in and make major changes, but. Tweaked anything? Makes any, any minor changes for the ball game, things like that? Oh uh, yeah, it's, yeah. Some, some in there. We're gonna throw some wrinkles in there. And uh, uh, coach has has his uh, style, and he's a very technical. Excuse me, has his very technical. He's a very technical style coach. And you know, personally, I I, I really appreciate that because you know, at next level, I don't know um, where I'll go. But you know, having a different perspective on how to play the position, like I said earlier, is is uh, it's crucial, and it's 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 good.